guys, it's Brittany with Eating Elephants, and I have an announcement to make, kind of. I am going to attempt, for the first time, to do VEDA, because I just so happened to do a video yesterday on April 1st, and if you don't know, VEDA means video every day, August, or video every day, April, and it is April now, so I'm going to try to do that, and <laughs> try is the keyword there. If I, I, I make zero promises, zero, I make no promises, but I will give it my best shot and um, see if I can make it through the whole month with at least a short video every day about different topics. It might be different topics. It might be a vlog, you know, it might be a random clip of randomness. I don't know. We'll see what, uh, what we have at the end of this month. Today, it's going to be a cloth vlog. Um, it's a cloth diaper haul. Uh, not everything that I have is a cloth diaper today, but uh, it's cloth related. Most of these are newborn diapers and covers and everything like that, but not all of them. I'll tell you what, what size and what brand everything is, so let's just hop right on in. So firstly, we have a pail liner. I have a pail, which is actually just a cheap trash can uh, that what we will use as his diaper pail and this is the diaper pail liner it is Kanga Care let's see if I can show you this the Kanga Care pail liner uh, the next thing that I have that's actually not a diaper is some used breast pads these were all um, 25 cents a pair and I'm actually I'm missing one I'm missing my other dotted one it's some it's somewhere around here but yeah, I have this dotted one, this she these chevron ones, and this pretty print there that I don't know how to describe. <laughs> I have some snappies. I have two snappies. One's blue, one's white. These are used to fasten prefolds and fitteds onto babies. Speaking of prefolds, I have three Grovia Blue Edge prefolds these are used as well I'm not sure what size it is maybe one or two I don't know maybe two but it's the blue edge Grovia it's used and I got the I got these prefolds I got three of them I got them mostly for my baby shower for the diaper game at my baby shower but you know I'll I'll add them to his stash and use them. I'm gonna actually order green mountain diapers prefolds for the majority of his stash but um, yeah, I, I've heard, always heard it's good to have kind of a varied stash so that you can see what works and what you like. And let's hop right on into diapers. I have a Grovia newborn all-in-one here. And my husband thinks this is kind of girly. But, and it is, it does have pink. But you know what? Colors are colors. And... <laughs> I'm just not one to follow socially constructed rules. I mean, I'm not going to put my son in dresses and princess outfits and stuff. But he can wear a diaper that has some pink on it. It's not that big a deal. But yeah, he, and my husband, he's not like, no, my son's not wearing that. He's just like, oh, it looks a little girly. But yeah, so it's fine. Um, this is the kind that has, it is all in one, but it has kind of a tongue sewn in as an insert so that it dries faster and it has one level of rise snaps so you can um, it, there's two different sizes and you can make it teeny weeny tiny and then a little bit less teeny weeny tiny but this is a newborn diaper so it's gonna be tiny either way and next we have this diaper I don't know what brand it is you guys I have no clue what brand it is there is a tag in here but it is completely washed out all of these diapers are used, so um, I'm not going to know the brand of all of them. But this has adorable pandas on it, and it has an umbilical cord snapped down there. And my husband also thinks this one is a little bit girly. But I'm like, what the heck? What's girly about pandas? It's an animal. Anyway, like I said, he's not upset about it or anything. And here is another diaper. This one is little Joey. There's the little label thing right there and this is also newborn and all in one and this one is they're all used but this one is actually very very white in the inside still it looks like it was barely ever used 
and everything is completely sewn in. It kind of has a double gusset here. You can see that. The light is kind of bright, so you can't really see it, but yeah, this diaper seems very, very sturdy, and it also has the umbilical cord snapped down. And here's the last all-in-one. It is Be Changed. I've never heard of this brand, but I'm excited to try it. Be Changed. And yeah, it's an all-in-one. Same thing, it's all sewn in, and it's very, very clean. They're, they're all used, but they're all very, very clean. This one has a true double gusset in this one. And snap uh, umbilical cord snap down there and yeah just seems like a really sturdy good diaper and then I have a couple of covers this is a rumperoos a rumperoos newborn cover there's the rumperoo label thing and it's it is all, everything else I've shown you has been snaps but this is actually velcro or aplex or hook and loop whatever you want to call it and it has crossover so you can actually cross the tabs over to make it teeny weeny tiny. And this is a this is a Thirsty's newborn cover. It has owls on it. And it is adorable. It uh it has three No, it has two levels um of snap down um two rise snap level to make it smaller. And yeah, the elastics are really good. The elastics are really good in all of these diapers. I wouldn't have bought them otherwise. Most of them were um, five dollars. Uh, a couple were actually eight dollars. But that's really, really good for all-in-ones and things like that. The covers were closer to three to five dollars, and then some of the all-in-ones were five to eight dollars. So those were really good deals, and I'm really excited about having those diapers for my little baby boy, and he's gonna look adorable in. Speaking of, follow me on Instagram because I post on there pretty frequently and um, you'll get to see pregnancy related things, life related things and very soon here you'll get to see the baby in all of his cute fluffy butt <laughs> diapers. So uh, that's really exciting and thank you so much for watching. Uh, Y'all give me video ideas in the comments for VEDA because I'm going to need it. I don't know what I'm going to make 30 videos about. Tell me what you guys want to uh, hear about. I'll probably talk about my hair in one and my car seat in another and some things like that. But I really do need uh, a little bit of inspiration. So thank you so much for watching. And how do you eat an elephant? One bite at a time. Bye-bye.